Hi everybody, it's Danny here from Angel Handmade Paper Craft. It is the last week of April. How crazy is this? So today I am sharing with you uh, another image from the Beach Gnome set fr uh, from Whimsy Stamps. This is the snorkel image. It is absolutely gorgeous. And I am going to colour him up using Copic markers. So for some reason I decided to put the card together first. I think because I was on the hunt for a certain paper that I knew that I had. Um, it kind of fell together and then I went from there. So completely different process to my normal. But this is what's happening. So here we go. This is the paper that I'm using is from... Um, which part is? I didn't even write it down. Is from America, uh, from Casa Craft. Let me just see if I can find it while I'm doing this voiceover. Should be right here in my stash. Yes, it is. Uh, the paper that I'm using is the Coastal Escape from Casa Craft. So it's a really cute, sweet, uh, beachy type theme paper pad. And it was exactly what I wanted for this card, exactly what I needed. And it was just perfect. So everything worked out. It's always a great card when, when you have um, a vision a vision of what you're going to do. So I've cut a few of the pattern papers down. I've also cut some layers of American Crafts cardstock and also some craft cardstock from Frencheville. I ran the image through my lawn through my Big Shot using a lawn fawn stitched circle die. Um, they're my go-to standard dies i've got a full set of the circle squares rectangles etc they're all lawn fawn so that's the reason why i use those we're bannering up a few of the papers and then layering them decorating the inside to the left as well i wanted to add one of these sentiment strips uh, from the paper pad so i'm just using my tim holtz guillotine to trim those down this is really a precision trimmer you can cut all these small pieces down without chopping your fingers and they will always be straight. So really happy with those. And just looking for one more sentiment to add to the front of the card. And I'm using the Celebrating With You today, which is from the Tailored Expressions Simple Strips. And we're just working out all of our layers. So just quickly adding all of those layers down and then we'll move on and we'll start doing the Copic colouring. So just quickly adhering everything down to the, inside, to the front of the card. So now we've got the card layout all sorted, um, we'll move on to copy colouring. So I did already trim this card out, this image out I should say, um, on my last video that I did using this image set and I'm just going to quickly colour it up. So I am using my Copic markers, I've already got the image printed out onto some Express It blending card and I am just going to go in, add in my darkest colour now. And then I'll work my way through and start blending all of that out. I'm just cleaning my markers off as I'm going in the background there. Um, my markers were a little bit dirty. So just tidying them up. So for the red markers, I am using R08, R27 and R37. For the... Uh, Swimming snorkeling gear, I'm using B uh, B four zeros and B double zero. For the little flower, I'm using some Y06 and YR24. And doing a million and one things at once in the background there as well, trying to find the markers I needed ready for the next area. For his little beard and his, yep, just his beard, I'm using T1 and T4. I wanted it to still look white but sort of blend as well so I'm adding in some ground there using W1, W4 and the Zero Colors Blender and finally just going in with my white uni ball pen to add all of the details in. 
a quick skin tone to his little nose there that you can see. I'm just using a triple double 20, uh, 11, 04 and R20. All right, I'm using some Helma scrap dots for my image. So giving it a nice squirt and then very carefully smoothing it out without pushing it. So my card is all complete. Here is a few photos of it all done. And I hope that you guys will stick around for another video. If you haven't subscribed, please press the subscribe button. If you like the video, hit the thumbs up and please leave a comment. Um, if you've got any questions, feel free to do so. All the details will be on my blog um, and you can catch me on Instagram, Pinterest and Facebook. See you all soon. Bye.